I'm about to pull a stump. We're not recording yet, right? We've got it kind of ready here. So we got another one to go. We pulled one already. So go ahead. I wanna see if I ever roll. I just That's good. So go ahead and slowly give it gas. Perfect. All right. Good job. Because <laughs> we prepped it correctly. Good job, Ashton. Yeah. Right out of the ground. I like didn't even give it any throttle that first time, but it ripped most of it off of the ground. I literally just was in neutral. I just rolled down the hill, which is kind of crazy, but they're not like huge stumps. They're just like little bushes. But he's done it before. And if you're wondering, we have the 1996 4x4 Yamaha Big Bear. It's pretty nice. Probably around 600, 700 pounds. Perfect for this though. Move the four wheeler back up to help prepare for the next one. We will pull shortly. I know my grandpa's just kind of digging around. Just pull it up by the roots, but yeah. Starts up every time, watch this. Neutral. So easy. I got the four wheel and moved up to here. This one seems like it might just be the exact same as the last one. It's, um, not very big, as you can see, it's just like a little bush. Pretty much, yeah. But once we're done with these, we had a tree a couple weeks ago that fell here so we hauled that cut it down now it's just a stump he drilled a bunch of big holes in here so we're gonna fill it up with like vegetable oil or something so we're gonna and then we're gonna burn it then we're planning on moving all these rocks and stones we're probably gonna move into my house and put it around the probably gonna put it around the tree in our front yard so once we're done with that So, we're wrapping the rope around the stump now. We dug yeah, around it. The strap set up so they don't bind really tight. Yeah. By using those dowels, wood dowels. This is just like a towing rope, by the way, just so you guys know. Yeah, we just have it wrapped around the axle here. We just have a solid axle going across, so. The four-wheeler is four-wheel drive, though, which is helpful, too, but. Yeah, it's already recording, so. Got it. Thank you. 
give it little bumps. Okay, let lighten up. There you go, do it like that. Perfect. All right, awesome. Exactly what I was hoping. That one had a lot of roof. That was huge. Yeah, as soon as I rolled down and started, and I did that little tuck thing I did with the last one, I'm like, okay, this thing's huge. And luckily on all of them, the roots were not very deep. They were just kind of wide, so. That pulled it out pretty easily, though. Now we're gonna go haul it down there. It's not that far, but. I'm just gonna record it. Ready for me? Do you wanna record while I'm driving? We don't need to record this part. Well, I kinda want to. Is it recording now? Yeah, it's already recording. So. Okay. Can you edit it? I'm gonna get yeah. We're just gonna dump this wood. Where are you going? I think he dropped his hat. Yeah, he dropped his hat. Well, well we're just gonna dump these over here, so. Um, thanks to my grandpa for recording me pulling the stumps over there. We just got back from hauling the wood down there. But we this thing, quick review actually, we got new tires on it like two years ago, so they're pretty new. They're, they haven't lost any air yet. I think he purposely aired them down. Um, I think I'm gonna record a um, video before this, an intro video that I'm gonna upload. Um, I'm gonna show a few clips of when we went mudding, but he aired these down for when we went mudding. But Yamaha Big Bear 350, it's from 1980, or no, no, it's 1996. It, we still have this from when we went to Wisconsin a few years ago, but it's in really good condition though. It has no rust on the frame for being 20 years old. I mean, there is some, like, hardened dirt and stuff. That's not, that, there's no rust in either. But there's, it's four-wheel drive, so. I think it did pretty good, so. Hopefully this video gets at least, like, five months, or, like, a hundred views. Um, and, like, a hundred likes in, like, five months. Probably won't get that much, but. Thanks for, or thanks to my grandpa for recording me pulling the stumps. So, hopefully you liked the video. See you in the next one.